Kevin Nagel, chairman and CEO of the Sacramento Republic FC, is no stranger to hard work. But it all started from humble beginnings in a small town in Minnesota with his first sports venture. I started working when I was six years old. This is a story that I've told many people where I actually started to, uh, I realized that I needed money for the family. And so what I would do is I would go uh, on, on, on a golf course early in the morning and I would retrieve golf balls. What I learned is that if I got to the 15th or 16th hole, some of those not so good golfers needed balls. And so I started selling them those golf balls. I would cut deals with them. I'd throw in an extra golf ball or a smiley golf ball if they bought one extra ball. And so um, I learned over the course of about six months that I could make uh, extra money. And so that was really my first uh, true entree into being an entrepreneur and understanding sort of the value of uh, deal making in the, in the world of business. Kevin's drive and determination led him to start and sell many successful businesses, but he never forgot his humble beginnings and the importance of helping others. Giving back to the community is sort of the mother's milk of uh, success. And, and, and to me, you're really not complete unless you, you give back to the community. And I always felt that that was really an obligation, a responsibility that I had if I was fortunate enough to be financially independent. And it's easy to, and it's a joy to. Um, I think that um, the gratification that I can say that I get out of giving back to the community um, is far more than anything financially that I've ever achieved. And so um, that has stayed with me, I think, when I was a young child because sometimes we were the recipient receiving assistance. And on the other end, um, now it's just a fantastic and, and liberating feeling when you can see that you've helped somebody. Kevin has made sure that helping others is one of the leading principles for the Sacramento Republic FC, including making a dream come true for a young cancer patient. So what we did uh, with this young man, and he was 15 years old, is what we did is we literally took him through the process uh, as though he was the professional soccer player. We made sure that he was eligible and that the league accepted him, and then we put him on our roster. He went through all the practices, and then the next step is that he actually got into a game and played under the USL rules, and, and he did score a goal. And it was really just a fantastic experience because everybody really within our organization got involved. So when I say that um, we're more than a, a soccer team, it's because of things like that, getting involved in the community in these small ways, which I really believe are big ways. Doing little things to make big impacts on our community is exactly what UCP does every day. I think UCP is a great organization. I think um, what they have evolved uh, over time when it started off with United Cerebral Palsy, and I think many people think that uh, Cerebral Palsy is really kind of the core focus, but they just do so much more than that. And I start thinking about um, the amount of resources uh, that they invest into things like autism, and I think that's even going to probably going to get greater. Um, I was just really awestruck by how diversified and how many people they touch in our region. And so uh, it's very easy for me to embrace, I think, just the wonderful things that they do and be a part of it. For his continued leadership and commitment to our community and Northern California, UCP of Sacramento and Northern California is proud to honor the 2019 Humanitarian of the Year, Kevin Nagel.